But anyway, chapter 23. I'll show you the way. So, last time Dorothy came and wrote down Nihilister. I'll show so, everybody get ready. Here we go. Come on, let's go. D Dorothy? What's she doing showing up here? This is the first time I've seen that, Nikkei. Do you know who that is? She's a pilgrim. Excuse me? Well, we've got raptures invading the Ark, then heretics, and now a pilgrim? Are we gonna be okay? We should be fine. If we look at the records from up on the surface, pilgrims weren't necessarily friendly, but they weren't overtly hostile either. I don't know why, but I think it's safe to assume they're not here to destroy the Ark. They also attacked the heretics. Well, <laughs> they're here for a right reason. Commander, what should we do? Tell you that much. I will be waiting here. Contact me immediately if something happens. No one. Okay. Everyone, we keep running into each other, it seems. Yeah, Dorothy, <clears throat> kind of weird. I was invited. Is she dead? For the time being, yes. Her throat was slashed clean through. Such a grievous injury would be enough to kill anyone. However, since she is a heretic, she'll be able to repair herself in no time. Oh, cool. So what do you intend on doing with her? It wasn't my original intention, but I'll consider her a gift to the Ark. What you choose to do with her is your business. This may be a bit overwhelming for my first visit, but it's nothing a gift can't smooth over. You haven't planted a bomb in her or anything, have you? <laughs> what reason would I have to do such a thing? Yeah, crazy. I possess weapons far more <laughs> destructive than a puny bomb. <clears throat> what happened to Papillon? Do people from Eden know about this? I realize you've all been caught off guard by my sudden appearance, but must you keep grilling me with questions? It makes it seem as if you're frightened of me. <laughs> Considering you downed a heretic with one shot, I'd say it makes sense for us to be scared. Don't be like that. I'm not here to talk about that. Answer the question. Papillon is playing her role perfectly well. She got me in touch with the Ark, and she is resting peacefully at Eden. She has agreed to keep me and the Ark connected for a while. Of course, given Eden's disdain for the Ark, this is all being done without their knowledge. So I'm afraid I'll have to cut our little reunion short. Where is Deputy Chief Burning Gum? What business could you possibly have with him? Quite a bit, considering he's the one who invited me. Just a moment. Enik, why are you calling me? Hello, this is Dorothy. Huh. A pilgrim? That's right. You actually came? Don't tell me you weren't being sincere when you invited me. N no, not at all. I'll send some troops over. Wait right there. No, I'll come to you. I can explore the Ark on the way over. And besides, I have a gift for you. If you could put up a map of some kind, that would be more than enough. Uh, uh, okay. Enoch, could you please take her to briefing room 13? Yes, sir. Enoch, send the coordinates to Miranda and me. Done. Huh? Miranda and I will be your guide. Us? And you two are? <laughs> We're the ACPU. 
the Ark's police force. Is that right? Well, any chance you can show me where I need to go? Sure thing! We've got you covered. Um, I have a question. What should we do about the heretic? Hmm... Carrying her would be awfully cumbersome. I'll carry her. Wow, really? Thanks! Thank you! Well, we better get going. Don't worry, Commander. We'll take care of it. See you later. See you later? Or like... <laughs> what is going on? I'll be fine. <laughs> if she was up to something, she would have made a move. Besides, the ACPU is a government-sanctioned organization. If Dorothy so much as lays a finger on them, the entire Ark will descend upon her. That's most likely why Polly decided to be her guide. Mm. I can't say I'm entirely confident in Miranda, but Polly is sharp as a tack, so I expect things will go smoothly. Yes, the two of them can handle themselves. Now what is Birmingham gonna give her? Or talk to her about? Temporary repairs to the Ark's roof are almost complete. A deployment of Nika units, led by Absolute and Matisse, is still fighting up on the surface. We have sent additional troops up to the surface, so there should not be any additional rapture attacks. However, there is still a large number of raptures remaining inside the Ark. Looks like a whole lot came down when they had the chance. There are still no reports of any Nikkei or human casualties. Everything seems to be going well, and will be sorted out soon enough. That's right. Even if you were deployed, it would be unlikely to make much of an impact. Commander, you want a bite? Yeah. During the rapture by exotic. While my mind was focused elsewhere, the exotic squad took advantage of that and disappeared from my radar. I am currently unable to determine their location. She is currently at the Massilis headquarters. The Massilis headquarters is one of the safest places in the Ark. So the CEOs of Elysion and Tetra are also with her. Hmm. Are we going? Roger. Let's move. I will send each CEO some relevant videos. After I have done that, I will go back to concentrating on the raptures inside the Ark. I will therefore be unable to provide you with much assistance. I hope you understand. I will. Someone needs to, need to oh, know wait, something. That didn't come out right. On my way. You want me sure, to go? Sure, kind of like oh, wait, like a threat or something. Come, right? come on, let's go. I'll I wish like you like way. you know in the lost sectors where you I'll can. You the way. If you're like above the number, you can just quick. You want me to oh, get on wish it? we could do that here, oh, man. Wait, that didn't come out right. This place takes so long. I hope nobody gets hurt. As much as it's like those ones are like, you have to wait like two minutes. For long to go through that barrier on the right. What is gonna happen? So what you're telling me is that the gaping hole in the Ark's roof, which caused raptures to come pouring in, is exotics doing? Oh, we're already here. Oh shit. I took a look at the data that Enoch shared. It's not enough to give credence to our suspicions. However, even though there is room for suspicion, we still do not have conclusive evidence. Les activities of exotic have been spread across such a wide area. Crow has purchased a bomb meant for excavation and then registered it on the dark net. Viper is only speaking to her acquaintances as usual. 
Jackal just gnawed through the rivets, keeping the elevator tied down. <sighs> However, there is a very simple way we can determine here whether our suspicions are correct. Right. It will be easily solved with a brain scan. <laughs> Nikki is kind of lucky that they don't make sure. deep brain scan. Otherwise, they would have been going cancelled by this actions. guy, I think. That will give us what we need to find out what role Exotic played in all of this. But it's funny though, I don't give a fuck. Why bother Mustang with is great. All of that? The evidence that we've got is already pretty damning. If you ask me, this case has already been solved. Why bother going through all these convoluted and unnecessary steps? Hey, what the? Have you lost your mind? Let me go! What do you think, genius? I'm going to blow their heads off! That's what they get for blasting a hole in the Ark. Good grief. You're always on the Nikkei's side, aren't you? Even when they've gone rogue. <laughs> what? <laughs> you completely lost your marbles since you came back from the surface? Listen, I Maybe? know you're not exactly my biggest fan, but do you really think I'd do something as despicable as trying to sweep this under the rug? <sighs> Let go of me. Don't press it. We need to be absolutely certain of who the culprits are. <sighs> what is wrong with you people? Also, we can Everyone just like... has been evacuated, and the raptors that have breached the Ark are all going to be taken care of. Even a heretic managed to find its way in, but apparently a pilgrim came and subdued it. This is an open and shut case. Why are you all insisting on making this more difficult than it has to be? If someone commits a crime, they should be punished. It's time that Exotic faces the music. I don't think this is as cut and dried as you make it out to be. The blame for this incident is being pinned on E.H. E.H. is the leader of Heavenly Ascension. And Heavenly Ascension is a terrorist organization in the Outer Rim. Do you understand what that means? I don't know and I don't need to know. It's not my business. The central government now has grounds to exterminate the entire Altar Rim. There was an act de Grachon Major which left a hole in the Ark. If they come to find that there's even the most tenuous of connections, they won't hesitate. Deputy Chief Dorman is already on the move. He despises the Altar Rim with a passion. We won't let this opportunity pass him by. We need to catch Exotic. The entire fate of the Outer Rim hangs in the balance. I wonder what's gonna... So what? Okay. What do we care what happens to people in the Outer Rim? Mm. I assume this is your telephone personnel. What of it? Okay. What the hell are you doing? Terribly sorry. I always seem to underestimate my own strength. You son of a. A Mustang Loki on your side. I leave it to you to track down Exotic. We would love to help, but there are still quite a few Raptors remaining inside the Ark. We've assigned all our manpower to focus on that. So we won't be able to lend you much support. Oh, like the whole Dorothy thing, we're However, gonna ignore that. That doesn't like, mean we'll be hanging you. We're not gonna to tell dry. anyone. 
We'll have Maiden and Guillotine from the Extrinsic Squad on standby. Nice. Should I mobilize the uh, Queen? The Underworld Queen? I thought they were lying low because of all the trouble with Dobin. <laughs> yeah, what would have been done? My queens would never let such a silly bagatelle get in their way. The same goes for Mon as well. What do you have in mind? I'm going to interfere avec Dobin's plans. Apparemment, he is gathering all his troops. I was thinking of dropping by and throwing a wrench in the works. Are you planning on fomenting a mutiny? Oh, heavens no! I don't want to hurt anyone. It will just be a little scuffle, that's all. Okay, I'm sure you know what you're doing. As far as tracking down Exotic is concerned, where are you planning to start? Sounds like a plan. All right then, let's get moving. Good luck! Hmm. Anderson is recuperating at the moment. Oh. Nothing life-threatening, but he's nonetheless indisposed. He won't be joining us for the time being. I'll give you the details another time. Okay. Good luck. Bon chance! Okay. Anderson is injured. I will look over everyone. Hmm. Okay. Let's head to the hot spring and take a load off. <sighs> I can't believe you're doing this to me. I'm not going to get out of here. You can't keep putting it. How dare those useless hunks of junk! Screw with Macillus! And after everything I did to bring Matisse to the top! <laughs> I can't let it fall. Never. Hey, did you bring your cell phone? Of course. Give it to me! Bruh, it's been too long, man. And I'm back in business. <sighs> Wait, what's wrong with this thing? Masilis's main communication line is down. What? I thought they were back up. It seems that our main communications hub just went offline. It will take some time to repair it. Until then... I'm afraid communication will be impossible. How the hell did the main hub manage to go offline? I believe someone mentioned something to the effect of teeth marks. What in the blue blazes is that supposed to mean? Interesting. I cannot say. I don't know all the details. I feel like I'm losing my mind over here. <sighs> Exotic, eh? Hey. You two. Yes? Yes. Go find Exotic. No matter what happens, you have to find them before anyone else does. What should we do with them once we find them? Kill them. Hmm. I'll turn off your inhibitors, so find them and kill them. Got that? Understood. Got Ooh. it. Now get going. Contact me if you find something. Communications are down. So, how should we contact you? The self-detonation protocol is the only thing linked to the main communications line. Whereas everything else shares a network with Elysion and Tetra. You should be able to contact me without any issues. Hmm. Okay. Wait, but like, aren't they still pissed at the one? You want me to get on? Are they not gonna like kill her when she that turns on the inhibitor? Right? You want me to get on? Or whatever the fuck it's called. Wait. Okay, outer rim time. Let's huh? see. Master, the partition is open. 
How come? I thought it couldn't be opened without permission from someone higher up. Not only that, it's super quiet out here. Too quiet. <laughs> no, the door wouldn't like going already to exterminate them. I always wanted to come to the ark. But I don't see a single soul out here. Hmm. We don't know why, but the main thing is that the partition is open. That means raptures can enter the outer rim. That might explain why it's so quiet. It's not like the outer rim has any safety shelters. Roger. Cadet! Cadet! Uh, who's that hollering over there? Cadet! Over here! Moran? Help me! There are raptures over here. So that's probably what they've been doing, Underworld Queen. Trying to protect the outer rim. <sighs> that was a close shave. I had no idea we'd run into raptures over here. Huh. Do you know who's to blame for all this? You'd better take a seat for this one. It was those jerks from X... <laughs> huh? How'd you know? Ah, oh, that makes sense. That's good then. I don't have to explain everything. I'm here to catch those bastards. Why could she like... Since Exotic has ties to the Kind of sounds tied, which I'm like sense. To start. But yeah. This is actually perfect. I was kind of worried going solo. Feel a lot more confident with you all backing me up. Someone left this partition open. So this entire place is teeming with raptures. Might have ended up in over my head. Since dealing with raptures isn't exactly my forte. What about Sakura and Rosanna? Beats me. They were wary of me and didn't provide any details. Those two drive me up the wall sometimes. They're always chattering with each other, yet they never tell me anything. Is everyone in the Outer Rim safe? Yes. Fortunately, there was a broadcast all over the Ark about the Rapture Raid. So, everyone was able to make it to safety in time. Did you find out anything about Exotic? I've been looking through all the evacuation camps, but they haven't uncovered anything yet. If we can find Heavily Ascension's main base, things would go much smoother. Exotic paid Heavenly Ascension plenty of visits. But they're always moving their base of operations to different locations. I'm not sure where they are now. Okay. Most likely. I'm sure we'll find something related to these recent attacks. Even better, those exotic punks could be there. Let's go to the evacuation camps first. I mean, exotic still in the arc, because they're like still messing around with stuff. So... Hmm. I wonder if Dorothy is in contact with them, bad. or something. This rink dink setup is like a house of cards. A single rapture could tear through this place like a bull in a china shop. Don't worry. If a rapture manages to break through, these people can still run away. Is that supposed to make me feel better? Hey, who's the leader around here? I am. Who are you? Don't you recognize me? Oh, Moran. I'm surprised to see you here. I didn't have much of a choice. This is the only decent refuge left. What about your kid and your brother? They went somewhere else. The raptures attacked when I was leaving for work. Are they okay? I'm not sure. All I can do is hope. Like I always have. I see. What's gotten into EH anyway? They should stick to issuing warnings or detonating government facilities. Whatever possessed them to blow a hole in the Ark? I heard rumblings about how there was a big attack being planned. Yeah. One which wouldn't involve any casualties. But I had no idea it'd be something so out of left field. And to resort to suicide bombings? 
How reckless and irresponsible can you get? It's not what you think. What do you mean? Because of this, everyone in the Ark thinks that we're involved somehow. And now we have no idea when or if the other shoe is going to drop. Not only are we dealing with raptures, but now we've got the central government breathing down our necks, trying to snuff us out. It's all thanks to the fact that EH comes from the Outer Rim. <laughs> this is a golden opportunity for them. They've always considered us a thorn in their side, and now they can get rid of us all in one fell swoop. I'm telling you, that's not what's happening. Fine. What is it, then? It's... <sighs> Looking for what? Who are you? Some kind of soldier? What's the military doing here? Uh, 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 we, we don't know anything. EH is the one responsible. It's got nothing to do with anyone else in the Outer Rim. Evidence? Like what? Come on, spit it out. I know you're not that high up, but you're no underling either. If I tell you, you'll leave us alone? I promise. No, your promise doesn't mean anything. I want Soldier Boy here to promise me. But do you even have the authority to back up such a promise? Well, I still don't fully trust you. We've done nothing wrong. This is all EH is doing. Why do we have to be dragged into it? Anyway, I'll tell you, if you promise to protect us. Is that a deal? Cool. Uh, all right. I'm just a bit sad, that's all. EH worked really hard. I know it's weird to describe a terrorist as hardworking, but... But she did everything she could to deliver Outer Rim's message without letting anyone get hurt. Unfortunately, that was met with significant backlash, and it only made things worse. She really tried to make the Outer Rim a better place for people to live in. But that's not what everyone believes. If you knew EH just a little bit, you'd know that she'd never do anything to harm the Outer Rim. As far as we're concerned, EH is the head of a terrorist organization. Nothing more, nothing less. The ideals and methodology behind it are of no concern to us. EH is a terrorist who poses a serious threat to the Ark. Yeah. All right, like... Terrorism shouldn't be justified under any circumstance. EH knows that more than anyone. She tried to walk a different path, but died before she could take the first step. It's just sad, that's all. Yeah. Shit, bro. I really like Moran's voice like this. Like how she's like chill or like sad or tired, right? Instead of like the way. shouting and Should stuff. I, go over there? Come on, I mean, it's funny because like she, she's you dumb and stuff. I never makes fun that of her, but like. Out, right? Yeah. This is also nice. Wait. Didn't is come out right. this it? According to the coordinates, yes. Okay. Considering this is their evil lair, I was expecting a little more. I thought there'd at least be a flag or maybe some statues commemorating their leader or something. <laughs> These guys don't have two coins to rub together. Do you really think they'd be spending their money on stuff like that? Is there any way to confirm that this really is Heavenly Ascension's main base? Smell it. Come again? Just breathe in deeply. <sighs> What's it smell like? <laughs> Ew! What is that smell? What is that thing? This? Just something random I picked off the ground. Why in the name of all that is holy would you put that under my nose? I was curious about what it smelled like. <laughs> why didn't you give it a whip yourself? Yeah, what's up, Knight? 
I can smell the gunpowder. Whoever was here, they were armed. That means okay. we're in the right place. The only problem is there's nothing here. Of gunpowder, and there are heaps of garbage Commander, on the ground. I suggest we have a look around. Yeah, yeah. There could be something tied to exotic. I'm probably gonna start struggling soon, so Just I don't know if I can finish it, but trying our best. Hmm. Something's coming. Ten of them. Ten of what? Okay. Mass produced Nikes. Nikes? Who are you? How did you get here? Uh, well, only see after. We? I just want to pay attention to this. Okay. The counters. Yeah. We heard that raptures had invaded the outer rim, and we'd come to exterminate them. Why enter from the inside? You afraid the raptures are gonna steal something? No, we came for supplies. Supplies? In the outer rim? You're here under whose orders again? Deputy Chief Dobin. Hmm. Okay. Interesting. Huh? <gasps> you rotten mother... <laughs> You're just using the Rapture invasion as an excuse to come here and wipe out those in the Outer Rim. Dobin was the one who opened the partition. Yeah. Wasn't he? No. I mean... Don't move. I'm taking those weapons from you and destroying them. I'm telling you, don't budge or I'll snap you in two. Roger. Okay. <gasps> well, okay, I'm getting abducted. Commander. Nice. Or is it just me and Rappy? Hmm. Wait, that didn't come oh well, right. what can you do? I was thinking to just use everything, but like, to get more crowns, but it's not. It's fine. Commander, I just rather collect okay? the Nikes as they come out. And then if I get more copies later on, then that's great. I am. According to my calculations, you must have fallen around 33 feet. I never okay. imagined there was a subterranean tunnel of this size. Yes, I saw. I'll contact Anise and Neon. I'm yeah, I've seen that. that. I'll be looking at the list. Pretty much any signal is jammed down here. Viper. I definitely Honey, agree. You aren't hurt, are you? Roger that. Oh, so that's how it is. Are you gonna stay put like a good girl, or am I gonna have to torch you? And just so you know, this torches Nikkei's just as well as it does humans. I see you're nothing if not well prepared. Yeah, I wish my head was like that. I remember when the banner came out. I had like 30k Chris, uh, gems and like a couple of tickets, I don't remember. But I had done like a bunch of pulls and I didn't get, I actually got Red Hood after the banner. And that's, that was so annoying. Like, how lucky could I get? But anyway. This is a secret passage connecting Heavenly Ascension and the Ark. I made a few alterations. If I catch anyone suspicious in here, I can burn them to a crisp. 
You see these holes in the walls? Behind each of those is a flamethrower. So I suggest you watch your step. <laughs> That's crazy. That quickly. Oh, honey buns. Why are you so grumpy? Nice. You used to I'm be I'm not that so lucky, nice unfortunately. What can you do? Hmm. Do you really want to know? Then follow me. I'll take you to meet Crow. Happy food and signals. Are those Persian bullets ready? Wow, oh, cool. Okay, I feel like Rappi is talking more in sign language than actually using her voice. Kind of crazy. Talking because you're too focused on my behind? Or are you and Rappy talking in secret? <laughs> How'd you know I was looking? <laughs> so you were sneaking a peek then. I mean... I'll try and sashay a little more for you. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy. The voice actress is Amelie. Honey, I can't like... Do you hate us? This is definitely a different character from what she usually plays. Why? Is it because we're behind all those terror attacks on the Ark? Or is it because of that little hole I made in your stomach? Hmm. Perhaps I should change the question. If you catch us, what will you do? Yeah, that is interesting. What? What? I mean, we're probably not going to do anything. It's just going to the central, central government trying to, like, decommission them or something. Okay. The raptures breached What's the happening? hole made in the Ark. If the timing had been off by even the slightest margin, things could have really gone sour. But we made it happen. And now you've come to apprehend us. In order to buy ourselves some time, we made it appear like Heavenly Ascension was behind it. Okay. However, I suppose it was only a matter of time before we were caught. It's okay now, since everyone is busy with the raptures. But if the entire Ark devoted itself to tracking us down... <laughs> well, I doubt we'd last more than an hour at best. I knew it would all catch up to us eventually. You could have just waited, honey. Why did you come looking for us? Was there something else you wanted to do to us? You're lying, aren't you? If that's really what you were after, you could have had Suin obliterate us with the push of a button. Hmm. So, hmm. is there still Weird. any hope for you to forgive us? Yeah. Why not? <laughs> I see. I mean, no one has died yet, so... Well, other than Nihilister, kind of. <laughs> Unfortunately. What a fool you are! 
covering for a terrorist? Are you looking to get a bullet in the head? Okay. <laughs> oh, it's nothing really. I guess I just wanted to see how far your loyalty toward us would go. You'll probably find it underwhelming, but if you really want to know, I can tell you- oh. Honey, can you show no. me your cell phone? <laughs> Come now, don't be like that. I'll show you mine if you show me yours. If you don't show me, I'll call my friends. Now, yeah, Viper, there's really a snake up in there. It's crazy. What? Oh. Uh, oh, but you gonna? But how did you give it up? Do you like want that? to be incinerated? In case you forgot, may I remind you about the flamethrowers I've installed? There's no gas or oil leaking out. There's no way this entire tunnel is outfitted with flamethrowers. It's too clean for that. There aren't any oil stains or burn marks. Okay. Knowing you, I should have figured you'd lie and tell half-truths. <laughs> That's precisely why I said we should solve this with our words. So why are you getting so riled we're up? We're winning? What is that? Oh, drone. Okay. It was like a chainsaw. Cool. Nice. We're dead. Ah, just another day in the arc, I guess. Drone has been taken out. Well, if Redford would be there. You couldn't have set up something this complex. Whoever did this, come on out. Oh, so they were all it's here. It's been a while. Oh, hey, Commander! Quite a reunion indeed. Uh... Violence is an instrument that no one wields better than a villain. I've been waiting for an opportunity to put my skills to the test. Okay. Commander! Master! Hmm. Viper. It's not like you to make such a blunder. Give me a break. I did my best. You call having your back to them the entire time your best? You should have had them walk in front of you. <laughs> That's no fun. Are you here to play with us, Commander? Commander, are you okay? Ooh. Cool. Master, I'm okay. Yeah, I saw the YouTube video on what that when they announced it. That would be cool. She wiped out those Nikes who got the jump on us, then headed towards the wall. She said she'll stop any more troops from coming in. She also told me to tell you she's sorry for not coming. Okay. Sounds okay. like we don't have to worry about her. Hmm. This should have been simple. I presume we have you all to thank for this becoming such a fiasco. You can think whatever you want. Hmm. Huh. Hey, should we talk? Hmm. Well, that's that then. Fighting isn't really my specialty, but if you insist. Whoa. Goodness gracious, Whoa, honey. That's... You're actually serious. I didn't think the commander would ever say that. <laughs> what I miss? Are we fighting? 
FYI, it doesn't count if you shoot them in the back. All right, everybody. I can take it from here. Just stay back and provide cover for me. You do realize that's another version of us fighting together, don't you? Is it? But I want all the credit. <sighs> Let's go. Okay. So this is gonna be like an actual boss fight or something? No one will get hurt. No, it's part of the story, okay. How did Reddit get ahead of Marciana? You like the burst timer. It's so weird. Anyway. You all just don't quit. We can thank all those missions. Or did Marciana die? Today. I wasn't paying attention, I don't know. Hmm. Right. All of the flamethrowers have been activated. What are you okay. doing? I'm raising the temperature and burning up all the oxygen. Okay. This is an enclosed space. Before long, this place will be like a giant. Oven. Yeah, that's what did that, yeah. <laughs> How could you? I wouldn't move if I were you. I'm the only one who knows how to shut these off. Don't even think about retreating. There's fire coming from the back as well. And like I said before, these flames can incinerate Nikes just as well as humans. Are you trying to suffocate us? Of course not. We're in no danger of suffocation. Neither yeah, and are I was you. thinking Nikes. Don't care about The that. same thing can't be said for the commander, however. Do you see this? An oxygen mask. So you were planning on taking the commander hostage this entire time. It was our contingency plan if negotiations fell through. And none of you exactly seem willing to speak with us. Fine. I'll play ball. Let's talk. Just hurry up and turn these things off. We're far past that now. Hand over the commander and we'll give him the oxygen mask. If we hand over the commander, how do we know you'll let us go? You don't. You're not in a position to negotiate. Yeah. Master, are you okay? Well, what's it gonna be? Uh, you still want to put a finger okay. on them. You're all dead. Why would we ever hurt, honey? That won't ever happen, so don't worry. So I ask you again, what's it gonna be? Just hold in there, master. We'll come find you. You, Neon, was it? That's right. That was pretty sneaky. But you need a little more practice. Yeah. I don't think we'll be needing this tracking device. <sighs> Everyone, hand over your cell phones. I don't have a cell phone. You're only harming honey by wasting time like this. The temperature is only going to rise. Hmm. Hmm. Bye bye then. This tunnel is a labyrinth, and we don't know which way they went. We'll only get lost. Then what should we do? Let's go back to where we came from and wait. What are you talking about? Wait for what? The tracker wasn't the only thing I slipped to Master. I also put a smoke grenade in this inner pocket. It activates when exposed to external pressure. When it does, it erupts into a giant plume of smoke. They discover the tracking device, but not the smoke grenade. All we've got to do is get to higher ground and wait until Master sets it off. 
They aren't bound to notice it, and when they do, they'll use it. That was incredible! Well done, Neon. Let's go. Ooh. So yeah, we're getting on, abducted go. again. Eh. Just another day. I suppose. On my way. Okay. And what else do we have? Okay, we're kind of close. So you want me to get might be the... able to do it today. You want hmm. me to get on it? Well, I don't think I'm gonna have to start playing. Especially because it was like oh, this is an educational experience. Those reactions were like well. the shield, or like oh, it takes long to kill them. Cool. Hey, Sakura. What is it? It seems that Dobin will be coming to the outer rim. He's already sent some troops. The entry to the partition was left open, and he sent in some armed Nikes that he'd hired illegally. I see. Is that all you have to say? Hurry up and get over here. I think this first batch was just an appetizer. He's intending on sending way more. I can't handle this on my own. I have my own affairs to take care of. I'm sorry, but I can't help you. What? What do you need to do? Something important. The Outer Rim may be wiped off the map. What could be more important than that? Moran. Do what you think is right. I trust you. What? Hey. Hey! What? She, she turned her phone off. <sighs> hey, jerk. What is it? Come to the outer rim. No. Come here and help me. Dobin. Left the partition open and used the raptures as an excuse to send mass produced Nikkeis into the outer rim. How did you know? How did you not know? Huh? Put yourself in Dobin's shoes. Huh. But I'm not Dobin. You've got that right. Anyway, I'm busy. I can't go. So do whatever you want. What, are you doing something important too? So there are some things you do know. Good. Go and fight your own fight then. Got it? Some help these two are. Oh, right. Yes? Didn't are you coming to help? Put on the phone. <laughs> nope. Just wanted to wish you good luck. Hey, I feel like I'm going crazy. Should I call my men? No. Then I'd really be putting their lives on the line. Huh. Moran, we're toast. What is it now? Dobin is on his way to the Outer Rim. Personally? Yes. Are you there right now? You better get the heck out of there. Oh, is Dobin gonna be like the boss of the chapter? Sakura really threw a wrench in Dobin's plans last time. The only reason you aren't all six feet underground is that Mustang stepped in at the last minute and convinced him otherwise. If you stand in Dobin's way again, he'll come after you with a vengeance. So what? What can he possibly do to us? You think he won't come after you? He doesn't scare me. Well... You should be scared. He already blames you for many of his misfortunes, and he'd jump at the opportunity to send you all packing. I suggest you sit this one out. Jin. If you're gonna prattle on about honor and all that crap, then save it. The thing about honor is... Hey! You've got some nerve cutting me off. Anyway... If I leave Dobin to his own devices, anyway. then everyone here is toast. I have to stop him. You might get hurt, huh? Wait a minute. What? Hmm. Oh boy. Hmm. What? 
You really are screwed. How so? Sakura is convincing everyone in the Outer Rim to lay down their weapons. And Rosanna is apparently going to take on all the troops Dobin is sending. Huh. What? Take on. Huh. I won, so seems fine. Miss, you're making a mistake. We need to defend ourselves. I'm going to make this short. Have everyone put down their weapons and stand by. I will do no such thing. Thanks to EH, the entire Outer Rim is now public enemy number one. Do you really think Dobin is just going to let us go? His goal in life has always been to wipe out the Outer Rim. Apparently, Deputy Chief Dobin has sent in troops, mass-produced Nikkeis. You see? We need to be prepared. Let's say Deputy Chief Dobin does bring troops into the Outer Rim. And when he gets there, he finds that everyone is armed and waiting. What do you think his next course of action will be? Uh. You all need to be victims. Act like them. After all, it's the truth, isn't it? So lay down your weapons. We need to avoid any misunderstandings that might arise. But Dobin doesn't think like that. He won't bother listening to us. He'll just wipe us out the first chance he has. Ah, uh, yes. There's something I forgot to mention. I was in a hurry, so it must have slipped my mind. Huh? Dobin won't lay a finger on any of you. The entire Semakai and I are behind you. It's not only Dobin. Whoever falsely pins these attacks on the Outer Rim will have to answer to us. <sighs> so please, for the last time, lay down your weapons. Or else I'll have to do it by force. You know I will. The Semakai and I always get what we want. If you want to test just how strong our resolve is, Keep holding on to your weapons, and find out. Consigliere? Yes, boss? How many minutes do you need to take care of them? Ah. Twenty mass-produced Nikkeis, was it? Twenty minutes should be sufficient. Dobin sent them. Unlike regular mass-produced Nikkeis, their inhibitors are probably deactivated. Don't think they won't be able to shoot you just because they're Nikkeis. They could be quite a formidable adversary. Understood. Good. Now wipe them out. Very well. Get some of your underlings to do the actual fighting. You stay here and chat with me. Is that okay? Of course. For this photo, sounds of gunshots and explosions. Never thought I'd be part of a gunfight inside the city. <laughs> and in broad daylight at that. <sighs> the only reason we could do it is because everyone has been evacuated to the shelters. Let's see. You said there were more forces being sent. According to our intel, 50 additional units are being prepared while Dobin himself is coming with 20. That man is crazy! <laughs> Raptures are running rampant around the Ark, and instead of help, this is what he does? He's got some bats in the belfry if he actually thinks he can take down the Outer Rim. <laughs> the notion does seem rather risible, yes? You said he's originally from the Outer Rim, correct? Dobin? Yes. He's saying like a Arizona is so fine, but I keep getting distracted. I swear. This place to the ark. <clears throat> anyway. In exchange for selling the outer rim down the river, he brought greater stability to the ark, and put himself on the fast track to becoming second in command. Let me ask you, why do you think he's chosen that path in life? Perhaps he wants to erase his past. Do you think so? Yes. 
For Dobin, coming from the Outer Rim is a humiliating blight on his reputation. My thoughts differ from yours. In my opinion... That psychopath just enjoys maiming people. He's human filth. <laughs> I cannot disagree with that assessment either. Anyway, what is taking them so long? Those mass-produced Nikkeis must be putting up a decent fight. Let's go. It's been a while since we've seen some action. There are plenty of other places we can help at. Yes, boss. I'm going to sing Lear now. <sighs> Sakura. Rosanna. Is a unique NPC. What are you going to do? Prevent any more reinforcements from coming and keep the people of the Outer Rim from bearing arms. There's only one thing I can do. I will halt the attack from Dobin's units. By yourself? By myself. Nah. Our reinforcements are late. What? The Underworld Queen? It's already here. <sighs> yeah. Those meddling bitches! Not again! <laughs> What I think when they find this game is funny, I don't know. Mongrels run free. It's like it doesn't happen often, right? No matter. It won't require many troops to take out those pieces of garbage. To all of you in the outer rim who are still alive, listen up. I want you to shoot these terrorists on sight. Now go! All of you! Hey there. Uh. You guys planning on going inside? Ah, I hate to break it to you, but this is my turf. And no one gets in unless I say so. She thinks she's so cool. Oh, I mean, she kind of is, Loki. You? Ain't gonna cap. If you value your Man. life, move aside. You took the words right out of my mouth. If you all value your lives, then scram. Or try and find another entrance. <sighs> no? Well, it'll be awfully humiliating if you head back with your tail between your legs after getting whooped by a single Nikkei. This is your last warning. Move! Like I said, nah, I this is my turf. The only way you're getting through is if you... One, kill me. Or two, pay the toll. The hey. toll is cheap. Let me suck you across your face. Oh, I don't think that's happening. Reality. It looks like you are coming too. Oh, you were going back to the feel, honey? Yeah. Commander, you're awake. <laughs> when you're pushed into a corner, you'll resort to extreme measures. Cliche, but true. Hell about having a look at the idiot box. Tetra Connect is broadcasting live throughout the entire arc. Even in the shelters. They must be preparing for the next broadcast. Before it starts, we should talk. Did you find the Vop House? So you did find it. Very impressive, as always. It seems there's nothing you can't do. How do you intend on getting out of this little bind you find yourself in? <sighs> Look. We're on the precipice of achieving what you always wanted. We're building a foundation upon which Nikes will receive better treatment. Let's start with Matisse. If there was no nymph, do you think a weapon without any coercion would actually fight alongside humans? This was the question I posed to the Ark. And what was the result? Nymph to Matisse, nymph to Matisse. Even those scumbags in the Ark knew it. 
Unless people have total control over Nikkei's. They would never protect humans willingly. Why would they, when humans only regard them as cannon fodder? Goddess of victory. <laughs> what a joke! It's simple. We were confident that Siwin would do something about it. Having said that, I had no idea she'd go as far as bringing raptures inside the Ark. Regardless, because of that spectacular show Matisse put on, they can now proudly say that Nikes are capable of, and willing to, protect humans, even without Nymph. <laughs> Is that what you think? Why do you think we made a hole in the Ark? I want something more. This so-called Goddess of Victory mantle they're thrusting upon Matisse for eliminating the Raptures is nothing more than a dog and pony show. They're nothing but dancing monkeys. That's why we made that hole in the roof. Unleashing Raptures and fear into a utopian setting like the Ark. I was curious about what kind of choices would be made in a situation like that. People will be struck with terror once they see with their own eyes what they usually only see on their TV screens. If raptures appear in the Ark, everyone will reach the same level of fear. Total equality. You're right. It's unfortunate. I never wanted anyone to die. That is why I chose the time I did. Matisse's victory ceremony. That way we'd harm the least amount of people possible. However, Enoch was more crafty than I anticipated. Enoch whisked everyone off to the shelters. To those humans in safety, Nikes and Raptures once again became something they only see on a TV screen. But then the real big bad came in. A heretic. I had high hopes. A heretic is evil incarnate and exists solely to commit evil against mankind. To my dismay, however, before anything bad could happen, it was taken out by a pilgrim. It just became more of a blockbuster. First, it was Matisse's little performance on the surface. Now it's inside the Ark. It's all one giant farce. The only thing that's changed is the proximity. If things continue along this path, I'll never get to see what I desire. I told you. I want to see the choice the Ark makes. Hmm, okay. I think I need to cook a little bit with that. Uh, like, is her plan actually gonna happen? Like, what? Like how? Like, like, aren't we like done with the raptures? It was annoying, but at least like. Now the goddess squad. Okay. The ones who up. gave everything for humanity, who were upheld as shining beacons of hope for the entire human race. They were unceremoniously tossed to the side the second the arc was completed. The decision was made all the easier because they were all cut off from the arc. After that. There was the first surface reclamation war. Those who willingly donated their brains to become Nikes were once again hailed as goddesses of victory. The campaign failed miserably. The Ark began to persecute the Nikes. They became useless devices that consumed far too much funds and resources and had nothing to show for it. That's about the time the term Nikkei phobia came into being. This was also a result of the disconnect between Nikes and humans. Then, the ginormous failure of the Second Surface Reclamation War. The first celebrity Nike, Pretty, passed away. The Goddess Fall incident with Model ZX. Every time there was a major occurrence along these lines, people in the Ark were moved. Praise, then persecution. Rinse and repeat. It was a never-ending alternating cycle as to how Nikes were regarded. I am convinced that disconnection is the biggest cause of all of this. Nikes reside in the Ark, but they don't truly exist. 
They're digital figments of the imagination, seen only on TV screens. It's the same dynamic as seeing a fictional character in a TV show and loving or hating them accordingly. Why is it this way, you ask? Because the people haven't felt it themselves. The Ark doesn't know the fear that comes with going up against a rapture. Why? Also because they haven't felt it themselves. The Ark doesn't thank or blame Nikes. Why? Still, because they haven't felt it. They know nothing about us. They don't know anything about raptures either. So we need to tell them. Only when they are finally able to truly understand Nikes and raptures will the Ark make a real choice. One of those choices might well be what you've always wanted. Greater respect for Nikes. Hmm. Let's just watch TV. Hmm. Visibility is pretty poor. Uni, won't we have a better chance of finding Crow in the Outer Rim? We've been wandering around downtown ever since we left. What I'm looking for is here. Hmm. You're not looking for Crow, are you? Nope. Then, what are you looking for? You have to trust me. I'll figure it out. Uni, please, let's just look for Crow. If we don't find her fast enough, then the people in the Outer Rim... Found it. Over there. Hey. Aren't they from Tetra Connect? Apparently, they're doing a live broadcast that's playing in the shelters. Let's go save them. <laughs> yeah, let's do that. That's crazy. This whole thing was planned. Oh my god. Because I thought there was a bit where Uni met with Exotic, right? On my way. Come so on, let's happening. go. Attention, Ark citizens! Are you seeing this? A rapture has broken into one of the shelters! Everyone who was hiding inside is dead. The raptures have figured out there are people inside the shelters. No shelter is safe. Everyone must get out of the shelters. If you stay there, you will die. Do not trust the central government. Your lives mean nothing to them. I repeat, the shelters are not safe. The shelters are not safe. I wasn't sure if she had what it took, but she's quite the thespian. <laughs> huh? How come we're laughing? Can I join? <laughs> oh, you got it all wrong. I didn't order her to do anything. I merely pointed her in the right direction. I have to say, though, I'm, I'm impressed. That was good thinking on her part. She took a rapture, blocked its senses, and brought it into an empty shelter. Then made it seem as if it stormed in and slaughtered everyone inside. Then again, capturing raptures is that squad's specialty. She's got a knack for fabricating tragic scenarios. Hard to say. Let's keep watching and see what choice the Ark makes. Say about that casualty rate. Oh yeah, those casualty numbers, eh?
파이팅 Finally, everyone will understand. What was once a distant fiction has become a tangible reality. They will be able to choose an informed choice that will come from experience. I figured as much. Then let me ask you one more time. What will you do to us when you capture us? Oh. Will you kill us? Or will you forgive us? Oh? Huh. Hmm. I see. Not quite the answer I was looking for. Those restraints won't break so easily. Grenade. I should have known. Okay. Already. God damn. Stop. It's a good thing we're not too late. What the heck are you doing crawling on the floor for, partner? Oh, I get it. You use the arcane technique. Tracing yeah. a Zisaru with your own body to gather power. This power is forbidden. If you use it recklessly, the interdimensional boundaries could... Just hurry up and untie the commander. Right away. Leave these three to us. You need to take care of what's happening outside. It's chaos out there. Nikkei's, humans, and raptures are all fighting amongst each other. Someone needs to get this situation under control. And you're the best man for the job. Please, hurry. If I may, partner, I'd just like to reiterate about the forbidden... Must be the one Captain was talking about! Huh? <gasps> Maiden! What? How can you...
Who are these two? Extrinsic. <laughs> Captain, did I do good? <laughs> you did very good. Well, did I do good? <sighs> Does she have her hearing sensor turned off? Correct. Who told you about us? Can't remember. Anyway, enough talk. Let's fight. Mm. Three against one, then, is it? Simple enough. Jackal, we're out of here. You deal with her. Ah, oh, dang. That's right. She can't hear. <gasps> You're not going anywhere. <laughs> Come play with me! <laughs> Leave this to me, partner. Go do what you need to do. Like, what am I gonna do? Yeah, for real though. Cool. Are you okay? What happened to Exotic? Why are you alone? And how come the smoke is coming from up there, but you're down here? Understood. Did blood just jump from a couple of stories? Roger. Okay, I'll head this way. I'll go this way. Most peculiar. I didn't imagine Indeed. I'd feel a sense of kinship with Maiden. <laughs> You're strong. This is fun. This is my first time seeing someone as strong as you. I always had her pegged as an indolent and badgering Nikkei, who, much like myself, had been cursed with immense power. However, when your attack managed to take her down, I realized something. You're really fast! I was angry. I was upset because I regard Maiden as my colleague. There's a music with it. You've helped me achieve a greater degree of self-realization. And for that, I shall give you the lethal eye. The lethal eye? No. <laughs> Which is like an actual power. Uh-oh. Holy art. God damn. Uh, what is this? Within my eye dwells tremendous and cursed power. The power to control all the energy I see. At this very moment, oh. I am scattering the energy in your core into the air. For us, Nikkei's, our cores are much like the heart. Right now, your heart has stopped. G G Captain! To you, I am the Grim Reaper, a killer of Nikkei's. You can never escape me or anyone in Extrinsic. You would do well to remember that. Right. You can't hear anyway. It's me. I've huh. secured Wild Dog. Yeah. No, it's not an actual dog. A member of the exotic squad, Jackal. Yes. Right. 
She's waiting. canonically OP. Did you against Nikias, anyway. Wow. You're awake. Well, I'd assume against Rapture as well, right? Seems like we lost Crow and Viper. Yes, but I was able to protect you and partner. For now, that's Actually, enough. yeah. <laughs> we failed our mission. She has real powers. <laughs> We're going to catch hell for this. <laughs> It was an oversight on my part for not considering they could turn their hearing sensors off. But why didn't you use your eye to begin with? Once I use my eye, it requires a lot of time to recharge. We've really screwed the pooch this time. <sighs> okay, cool. So, Jack was dead. All right, not there. That's cool. I... Oh, wait. That didn't All come here on the right. side. I'm almost done here as well. Fucking Rapunzel, I swear. Lord of class. Yeah, this is gonna be against the Let's go. Rapture. We should be able to make quick work of So we're not gonna go back to Dobin and Moran? Nope, I guess not. <laughs> not yet anyway. Yeah, I remember fighting that bo this boss before somewhere. I don't know if it was like a solo raid for their is a king's duty. or something. But yeah, I fought that guy before. So I was able to remember quickly. Enemy down. All raptures in the immediate vicinity have been eliminated. Wait, Enemy down. What is Yeah. Hello? Commander! Are you okay? Diesel? Okay. Oh, thank goodness you're safe. That's all, they're bringing all the random Nikes this time. That's crazy. to Vasilis's medical center. Okay. Support troops are on their way. Stay there until then and do what you can to assist. Try and keep everyone from panicking. We're going to be using AZX. There's a station right in front of the medical center. The tracks aren't in the greatest shape and there's plenty of other things that could be better. But we're diverting all our attention to get these people to safety. No problem. All right, that was the last of them. We administered all the first aid that we could, but are these people going to be okay? They'll be fine. The central government will take care of the rest. Commander, we've just received confirmation that Jackal has been captured. So that leaves Crow and Viper. Huh? Isn't capturing Jackal enough? Crow is the ringleader. If we want to really end this, she's the one we need to capture. Where do you think they've gone? Sure, we just need to search that shelter over there, and we're done. Oh, am I dead again? 
Commander. Why don't you sit down over there for a minute? We'll go check it out and be right back. This place is safe, so you can rest for a moment. Oh, I see. I'm just tired as fuck, I guess. It's been a long day. Commander! How? <laughs> Did you bring a present for me? You told me oh, the... you'd give me some Bop House. So I could have my revenge. You'll save me, won't you? You saved Matisse, so it wouldn't make sense if you don't save me. Someone as kind as you wouldn't pretend to not see me, would you? Yes, Commander. Do what? Hmm. Hmm. Keep on the ground. Was that me? Mm. Yep. <laughs> I knew you brought it. Some bop house. Just for me. Thank you for thinking about me, Commander. <laughs> Thank you, Commander. Hello, all Ark residents. Huh? I am AZX's attendant, Diesel. I will be escorting you all so so many, like, to Macillus's medical center. Twists, like every, if you experience any like, trouble during the journey, just ring the bell like and we'll be there to assist you. We have several attendants, including myself, on standby. We'll be arriving at the medical center in about 10 minutes. And with that, we're off. Hmm. What? Ain't no way. Well then. All right, not there. <laughs> 